What's up guys and cows, Subatomic here. Today, we're going to be playing um, Jedi Fallen Order. So, comment down below, like, and subscribe. Trying to get to that 1k by the year. Fucking by the year, we always have next. But I really appreciate it. And I'll explain later in the video when the recording starts. Uh, I had to redo the first. Okay. Yeah, anyways, I'll explain it. I'll do a little hints and whatnot. But anyways, I uh, hope you guys enjoyed the video. And let's get into it, shall we? Mm -hmm. <clears throat> oh shit. Here we go again. Which won't. Pay me 20 over. That'll do. Get to work. Right behind you. Don't look at that. Don't look at that. I totally haven't played this game already. No. I totally didn't forget to record audio for the beginning uh, 30 minutes of the video. No. What are you talking about? Anyways, this is better anyways from actually just giving the... <laughs> <laughs> the part that I didn't have audio on. Because I had to stop the video so many times. Hey, you look at that. A separatist ship. I haven't seen a Luke or Hulk in ages. Yeah. Ages. Breaking her will be big money. Alright, let's go. Plus, I've already played this game, like, when it came out. And, like I said, I'm playing Jedi Survivor next. If I can get that damn thing to run. I should have it running now. My PC is struggling. I need a better, um... I need a better CPU. It's all my voice actor. I think. The English voice actor. <laughs> Alien language. They don't even bother putting... What it actually, they're actually saying. Found that funny. Plus, just just shortened the time that it took me to do the fucking beginning of the game. Because, uh, yeah, like I said, I had to stop the video like 20 times because I was trying to get the controller to work.
Sounds like scrap rats. Scrap rats. Just passing through, guys. No need oh, to mommy. Say hi this time. Meet you the clamps. The clamps, got it. <laughs> Brother. Don't worry about it. Look, the ship cutter is here. There it goes. The fuck am I going to go this way? No? This way. I'm dumb. Isn't it like a giant lightsaber, pretty much? Well, it's not a light lightsaber. You know what I mean. Feel like this? It'll be your ticket off this soggy rock. What makes you think I want out of here? <laughs> Come on, Cal, you're a young guy. You don't end up like me. <sighs> Eventually, you gotta move on and live your life. Find your destiny. Whatever you say, hey, we should get back down. You're not listening to me, though. Skirty, skirty. Oh. Oh, shit. <clears throat> Get some grip. You're an octopus. He fine. Thank <laughs> you. 
You all right? Yeah. Okay, we gotta... We gotta move. Come on. Yeah. What happened? What was that back there? Was, it, was that you? What, that, that was the force, wasn't it? Just forget what you saw, okay? Please, no, trust me. I've seen, the, I've, I've seen the stories. I've heard it. Shut your mouth. You're gonna get excused. Anywhere is it safe, man? Just gonna head back to my place, grab my bag. Tappers owes me a favor. I heard he was up on uh, Nashadoa. Yeah. You won't be seeing me for a while, bro. Yeah. Yeah, okay. Okay, Kel. Move out of my way. Where'd you go, Probby boy? Probby boy. There you are, Prob boy. Come here. I need to tell you something. And then I gotta smack this shit 66 times. <clears throat> Execute order 66. There it is. Stick transmission. No transmission. Trans. Transformation. No. Transformation. No. Transition.
not the ninth sister. No, that's the second sister, ninth sister. My bad, I got him wrong. The ninth sister is the the Hulk looking ogre. Second sister is the kind of the, the kind of hot one. You'll see later on in the video, the, the playthrough. This is no common anarchist, but a devotee of the treasonous Jedi Order. <sighs> Failure to turn over this traitor will result in a charge of sedition. Turn yourself in, or everyone present shall face summary. Execution. I think it's time someone came forward. I, uh, I've been working on this heap a long time. Way before the war. We refit and rebuilt ships. Best in the galaxy. Then came the Empire. And engineers became scrappers. The workers? They just started getting worked. Prof. We all know the truth. We're just too afraid to say it. To the Empire, we're all just expendable. Yes. You are. No! Look at this. A lightsaber. I found the Jedi! Oh. Oh, that's dope as hell. All right. I go up or I go okay I go down
Am I still recording? I am. Good. Give me a second. Alright.
and stuff. I'm on my dead, bro. I'm on my life. Lifeline. I'm on my deathbed right now. Oh yeah, this is the boss, right? I am no Jedi. Going somewhere. I recognize that stance. Perhaps you've had some training after all. Who's your master? Padawan? Someone I killed, perhaps? What Jedi gave their life so that you might live? Oh. I know to evade, god damn it. I played enough Dark Souls. Dumb little fuck, bruh. Aiming that thing around. Okay, shut that thing off and grab some seat. Thanks for the help. Who are you people? My name is Sir Junda, and this is my captain, Priest Ritus. How you doing? Yeah, the man is my ship, but you better pay attention to this lady here. So. Who are you? Cal, Kestis. Who was that back there? An Imperial Inquisitor. She's a Force user hunting Jedi survivors. And now that she knows who you are, she will not stop until she destroys you. How do you know so much? Uh, why'd you help me? We track Imperial communications. We heard the Inquisitors were heading to Brock. So we made our move. Oh, yeah? What's the bounty on Jedi these days anyway? That's gratitude for you. Look, I get it. You've been surviving on your own for so long that it's impossible to trust anyone. And it's what's kept you alive. But this is about something bigger than just surviving. 
But what? Like rebuilding the Jedi Order. Ah. Luke tried it two times, in fact. Failed. Movie wise. Oh, we're not good enough for you? The Jedi Council. They're gone. Boo! -hoo. Oh, sorry. I'm sorry, guys. <laughs> sorry. Sorry, cool. <laughs> Try and relax. Go. You're safe. For now. You gotta move on and live your life. Find your destiny. Calico. You were talking in your sleep, but weirdo. Start playing it. Start playing the tunes. There, that's better. events connected to it you feel its history it's an echo in the force from the object not many jedi have that skill how would you know that why why i was one why but not anymore why no but i knew your master general de paul he was a true guardian of the republic was a hero. Mods interfering with each other. Listen. Something happened to me during the purge. I survived, but my connection to the force is damaged. When I meditate, if I let my guard down, I lose control. And it's like I'm back in that moment when you survived, Cal. And you're not alone. Anymore. We'll come up on our destination. My PC does not like that. My PC does not like this. doesn't know this place exists no so what's the plan we hide out here we're done hiding Cal. see that structure over there i believe that vault holds the key to rebuilding the jedi order yep but sure it requires someone sure it's test and since you're not a jedi anymore that's why you need me i know you don't trust me and I'm not really sure I trust you. But we have a common enemy. And a common cause. I'll share more of my plan after you reach the vault. But, until then, there's someone here I think you should meet. May the Force be with you.
Rock. My PC's struggling. <laughs> Go over there, yeah. I think you need a skill. Is this when BB-8 shows up? It is. No, BB-8. BB-1. BB I think I should be able to... Not epic. Hi. Yeah, that runs. That's the vault Seer mentioned. Whoever I'm supposed to find must be waiting there. It's your map. Mm-hmm. Yeah, I need to go over there. Over there, that doesn't look safe. Just like back of the scrapyard. Hold on, I'm coming. BD one, my bad. Cutie. And I wish I could have a, an action figure of him. He's like a little chicken. Robot chicken. Oh, we got green. I'll show you green. I 
I do have orange, which I already have orange. What does this one orange look? <laughs> this is a more darker orange. Which I might... The sabers. This is blue. Which is, hmm. I need to make that one lighter. I'll show you green. Might just make the other one blue, to be honest with you. Hold on. No, I don't want green. Not the. Skills. That's where we need to go. I can feel it. All right, we're back on. I don't know. Where do I? There it is. We're back on track. These tutorials, man. I can't make it over there. We gotta find another way. Hmm. 
I think I can make that jump. Hell yeah. I know how to open my map. Map. All right, I'm going in the right direction. Bruh. An ogdo. Right. Difficult, Master. Yes, the path is difficult. It may seem impossible, but with persistence and the Force as your ally, you will overcome any obstacle. You will master any path. Now, do what you must to reach me. I didn't do it. And that big creature's up there.
Okay. Can't make that. What? Oh, fish. Oh, it's right there. Duh, I'm dumb. Go to skill tree, see what skills we have. Uh, unlocked. used by someone eager to reach the vault. Thanks, BD1. A bog rat. So you just insta die. Damn, can't get no shortcuts. Unfair. How the fuck do I get back? Here. Help. Can you 
slice this? Yeah, sorry about your scoff link. But standing up to that bog rat? Pretty brave. What is it? See there? Oh, it's on. We're not finished yet. Okay, okay, you probably would have won. Probably. Open up this hole. So I haven't been talking much. I just woke up like two hours ago. I know that's probably a lot of time for some people. My God, I'm like a hibernating bear or something. civilization known as the Zephyr. Meditating here, I was granted a premonition through the Force, a vision of doom. I have placed inside this vault a Jedi holocron, containing a list of the names and locations of young Force sensitives throughout the galaxy. Ahead, you will find the inner chamber of the vault, but also another test. I can only trust this holocron to someone who has followed my path and understands. Seek out the hidden tombs of the three sages and learn to perceive the mysteries of the Force as the Zephyr once did. In this droid, you will find everything you need to succeed on this journey. Go to the Zephyr homeworld. There, you will find peace in the eye of the storm. Good luck, Jedi. And may the Force be with you. All right. Thank you for the kind words. I guess you were the someone I was supposed to meet. Cam, did you get your old ass wet, man? Sounds like you did. We'll be waiting.
Go my ass, frog. Go my ass, frog. My PC is struggling. Bones, the fuck you think it is, bro? sort of fascination with a place so dark. Okay. Okay. The Jedi use this place to study the sphere above. I can still feel the excitement. Brother. Bruh. Bruh. Brother, I do can't jump or shit. Can't I can't even make that jump? Where the fuck am I supposed to go then? I figured it out. What? 
Toss me a stem beating one. Better. You passed the test. So you knew about BD1? Come on board. We'll talk inside. Oh, BD1, this is Grease. Hey, Grease. What is that? Get off my sofa! Get, get off my sofa! Don't get out of there! Get out! That is BD1. He's with us. I don't care who he's with. Do you have any idea how hard it is to get oil paint out of patrolling me, fabric? Not really. Oh, I hope you found something better out there than this droid. Oh, calm down, Grease. He did. Tell us, Cal. The vault was built by an ancient civilization called the Zepho. A Jedi named Eno Cordova hid something inside of it. What did he hide inside? A holocron from the archives. It contains a list of four sensitive children. The next generation of Jedi. I knew it! Ah, oh, Cordova, you old fool. You knew him? Yes. A long time ago. I was his apprentice. Uh, I was a loner. Sorry about that. Droid and I are probably the only ones that know about Pagano. Hold on, wait a minute, wait a minute. A hollow what? A holocron. It stores information, but only accessible to Jedi. Hang on, I think I have... And Sith. I think. Right? Can the Sith force it open? No. I don't think they can. Can they? I don't know. With that list of Force Sensitives, we could rebuild the Jedi Order and defeat the Empire. Okay, no problem. Let's get it! Well, except the Holocron is hidden deep inside the vault, and to get it, we have to follow Cordova's path. He mentioned something about the planet Dathomir and a Zeppo homeworld. All right, well, where are we going? I'm just asking because I was thinking of maybe making some food. Look, before we do anything, I need to know something. How come you're no longer a Jedi? I had an experience that changed my perspective. So I cut myself off from the Force. But you still want to rebuild the Order? I believe that rebuilding the Order is the best chance we have against the Empire. What do you believe? I believe I can't keep hiding from the Empire, so I don't really have a choice. Cal, as long as you're alive, you will always have a choice. Are you with us? Either with us or against us. <laughs> Death mirrors Zepho. It's your choice. Dathomir or Zepho? Hmm. Which planet next? Go here. So, if the order thing is revealed, do you think any Jedi will come out of hiding? Mm, what makes you Don't mind my cloak. It, it, it has a mind of its own sometimes. Curious. Is there someone specific you're thinking of? Well, growing up, we heard tales of a green, pointy-eared, legendary Jedi Master, and... Are you talking about Master Yoda? Yes, he is very legendary. Wait, what? Who? No, no, I'm talking about Master Yaddle. The Jedi High Council member? Yeah, we all have our dreams, okay? Let me have mine. <laughs> no problem. All right, kids, sit down. We're here. Think of a storm brewing down. Fuck, it just disappeared, man. Might not be the best time to land. Yeah, something strange. Those winds are interfering with our comms. Hey, Cordova mentioned something about peace in the eye of the storm. Well, I can just make out a settlement in the middle of it. Then we have to get there. Copy that. Oh. A 
up above ain't gonna kill you, kid. <laughs> Unless the wind picks up. <laughs> Can you tell that bucket of balls to keep his opinion to himself? I'm sure everything's under control. It's under control. <laughs> it's a little tricky. <laughs> Still getting a lot of interference on the comms. It's gonna take me a minute to get them back up. I'll search for signs of Cordova in the meantime. Good. I'll be in touch once I crack this. Cal, over here. We did good work on Pagano. The more information we gather on Cordova and the Zepho, the closer we'll get to stopping the Empire. I've heard of ancient cultures, but don't know much about them. I only knew that Cordova was obsessed with the Zepho, believing their teachings to be important. I, too, was intrigued by the mysteries of our galaxy. You better get moving. There's a lot to learn here. Good luck. Good luck. Well, that's going to be the end of this video. Hope you guys enjoyed. But like always, peace.